So that's a pretty good key uh, based on the kinds of things that we've, we've worked with here. Um, for more information on the uh, individual settings, uh, we'll do that in another, another tutorial. So now if I play through this edit point, you can see that we have the key here, but when we play over the edit point... It truly communicates you're being attuned to what the client is saying. Goal direct it jumps back to our uh, original, <laughs> original clip, and that's uh, our original view of the clip, and that's because these effects are not applied to our footage as a whole. They're applied to our individual pieces here in the sequence, and the way that we can take these settings and add them to another existing clip is uh, is fairly easy. And the uh, great thing about it is that it keeps us from having to uh, redo work. So if I right click on the clip that's been cre uh, corrected and I do copy, and I come over here and I right click or control click on the clip that needs the adjustment, I can do uh, paste attributes. And what Paste Attributes does is it takes whatever adjustments have been made to the clip that was copied and it will add them to uh, the new clip that has just been selected. And you want to make sure that anything that's been changed has the little checkbox uh, in front of it. We'll make sure our effect is there. Don't have to worry about the volume, but uh, that's there too. And if we click OK. And now when we play over that edit point, it's got the exact same settings, so there's no uh, disruption in the way that things look visually. Uh, so that's a great way to uh, make sure that you've got consistency across the board.